Uh, I'm Nick Donnelly from the University of Southampton. My team and I are studying what makes some people uh, better than others at finding rare targets or targets that are hard to find through being camouflaged or hidden. The scope of the work is wide. Determining what leads some to be good at detecting uh, threats in images will make the difference between finding and not finding threats in X-ray baggage at airports and other venues, noticing subtle but worrying changes in aerial uh, images uh, of the ground taken at different times, that, that the effective monitoring of CCTV images for emerging risks. We see three sources of variation that will contribute to different abilities in threat detection. First, people vary in the efficiency with which uh, basic human perceptual, attentional and cognitive systems work to search visual scenes. The efficiency with which these systems work will be affected by differences in a range of cognitive, psychological and demographic factors. Second, the effectiveness of the training techniques used to improve performance overall and to reduce differences between individuals. Third, the, effect the effectiveness of strategies such as providing automated aids to search influence the effectiveness of search without changing a person's skill in aiding search. Starting from considering our own work in detecting threats in X-ray images, images taken when route marching in Afghanistan, the monitoring of CCTV by police and the search for hard to find targets in open ground, in our project we are reviewing the breadth of existing literature. Our hope is to provide clear criteria for advising on the personal attributes of those best positioned to develop the skill sets for finding threats and hard to find targets across the range of threat scenarios. To find out more information about our research, you can visit the Crest website.